Good morning everyone and welcome back to another video. So we've got a very interesting project lined up for today. Right behind me over there, there is an unusual looking window that doesn't match the rest of them in this kitchen. So what we've got to do is we've got to knock it out, expose the beautiful original stonework and then see what we've got to do after that. So we better crack on. First things first, we need to remove the old window before we can remove all of the stonework. So let's get on with that. Um, hopefully these windows just lift off and the frame we can just cut and remove gently without breaking any glass. Yeah, so we've got to get the jackhammer out. Oh, I love a bit of jackhammering. It's fantastic, it is. It just, it just validates me as a, I don't know what, a builder, a fake builder. Um, so yeah, let's crack on. windows came out incredibly easy but the frame I think is probably stuck in there quite well so I need to get a hammer. first there's a lot of lead paint in this window and I don't want to breathe that in there's literally lead paint everywhere at this place asbestos lead paint lead pipes probably no there's not really just a bit of lead paint right I'm going to use this to cut through it so I can pull the frame out we're not going to reuse this window at any point because it's pretty knackered but let's get on with it that barely any wood left it wasn't too bad a little bit rotten too high up okay right let's try and pull these bits out now Make a bit of a mess. I'm just going to put this crack on helmet on just in case any plaster falls on my head. Um, I actually wear the helmet more often than I should. I know I'm working in probably quite a safe environment most of the time, but I have Bluetooth headphones on so I can listen to music, get into the vibe a bit. That makes any sense. Right, let's crack on. Nice and easy. Let's 
What I'm going to do is just get up there now, Alex, and just chip off a bit of the concrete. Okay. The window is out. All of the cement and anything holding the old window frame is also out as well. What we've got to do now is, I need to remove all of the block work below this window because originally this used to be a door to the courtyard and I want it to match all of the other windows. So I'm not gonna put a door back, we're gonna put another window back in, obviously when the carpenter is finished with the ones that he's currently doing for this kitchen. Um, so yeah, he should be here next month, hopefully. Hopefully, fingers crossed. But um, in the meantime, we can do this anyway, so at least it's done, out of the way, and we can move on to other jobs, because at the moment, obviously, I'm a one-man team at the moment, and a family friend is coming out um, in about 13 days, and he has, actually has a house not too far from here, about 10 minutes away, which he wants to renovate, and he is a builder. But he is mainly a plasterer, so he's gonna crack on in this kitchen for me for about three months straight work every day and um, on the weekends he's going to do his own place up a little bit so it's going to be fantastic what we're going to do now is we're going to take out all of the stonework in this oddly shaped window setup and this actually used to be a doorway to the courtyard and i've got no idea why they blocked it up but we need to remove all the block work now and make it look like the other windows in the room so let's crack on <music> Right, we are ready to smash this wall down. Um, I've got the jackhammer, it's all plugged in. I've got eye protection, so no chips of stone go in my eye, anything like that. Um, so yeah, the only issue is, I don't want any rubble to fall on the wisteria right there. So I'm gonna try and loosen it and try and push it sort of like there, but it should be okay. Right. That lintel was rock hard, but we've got through it and it looks better now it's lower. Obviously we've got to go much lower, but yeah, it's going quite well. This is a bit of a funny angle with this jackhammer, but it's fine, it's fine. Um, so yeah, let's continue.
This wall is solid. It's taken so much effort just to get down to this level. I'm exhausted. Also, the angle of holding this jackhammer on that lift, rather than vertical doing the, fl the floor that we've just recently done, this angle is very difficult, but it doesn't matter. We got this far, it's fantastic. Um, it's letting so much more light into the room. Um, and you can see parts of the building from inside the kitchen that you wouldn't normally see. So it's fantastic as well. So we just got to come down a little bit more and then we've got to clean up and then we've got to figure out what we're going to do with it to make it match the other windows because it's missing a granite lintel and yeah, things like that. So let's just crack on a little bit more, see what it looks like, clean up and then we'll figure out what we're doing. Oh, oh it's heavy. Okay. We've done it. We've exposed and opened the original doorway. It looks fantastic. However, there is a slight dilemma. And if you haven't noticed it yet, you haven't noticed it, but I can clearly see it. But we'll get there in a minute because we'll clean up all of this rubble. So my good friend, Ryan's gonna help. Yeah, he's gonna help. So let's crack on. Right, so these stones are really, really nice and I don't want to just dump them with the rest of the rubble because we can reuse these elsewhere. What do you think, Ryan? Let's do it. Oh. So what do you think everyone? It looks fantastic. However, the problem is the bottom part, it doesn't match the rest of the windows. And obviously it used to be a doorway, so it never did. So what we need to do is we need to scour the property and look for some appropriate pieces of granite to try and match the other windows. I don't want this to be a doorway because we've got a door there and a door there. I mean, there's literally doors everywhere. If we keep reinstating doors, it will just be like a facade of doors essentially. So we don't want that. This is going to be a window and plus i've ordered the window already i can't go to the window carpenter and say i want a door now he's probably already made the window <laughs> so it's a bit late for that anyway it's fine it's going to be a window 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 so tomorrow starting tomorrow we're going to look for the granite we're going to bash out the rest of this and um yeah see what it looks like so there we go brilliant great day's work so thanks for watching everyone I'll see you all tomorrow.